Good morning, Patriots. Welcome back to Rex Pines TV. I'm Eli Santiago. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for our school mission statement. We the Patriots achieve greatness through high expectations, passion, and perseverance. Thank you. You may now be seated. Today is Tuesday, February 20th, 2024. I hope you had a restful break. Now let's go to Catherine for today's Black History Spotlight. Thank you, Elia. Hey, Patriots. For today's Black History Spotlight, we will be shining on Otis Boykin. This famous inventor was born in Dallas, Texas in 1920. Boykin had presented 27 inventions, including a burglar-proof cash register that helped many small businesses. Also, his most famous invention is a chemical air filter that was used by the U.S. military. Otis made a small device called a pacemaker that helps people with irregular heartbeat. This man invented everything. Now let's check in with Samar for today's lunch. Thank you, Catherine. Today's lunch is corn dog, Italian sandwich, seasoned Italian veggies, red bell pepper, garden side salad, sliced pears, and your choice of milk. Tomorrow's breakfast is whole grain donut ring, Fruit Loops, String Cheese, Fresh Banana, 100% Grape Juice, and your choice of milk. Students, please keep in mind the lunch period can charge at any time and to always bring a lunch card. And don't forget to let your teachers know if you will be receiving lunch today. Bon appetit, let's go back to Elia. Thank you, Samara, that sounds delicious. For today's Black History Month activity, you should be reading a book that celebrates African American musicians during the Harlem Renaissance. And tomorrow, get ready to discuss your favorite black actor and actress. Tomorrow, 5th and 6th, we'll have a chance to go to the Patriot Store. The store is open from 7.15 to 7.55 a.m. Make sure to come on time. Patriots, keep your phone shut down and in your backpacks at all times and there is no chewing gum in school. Please spit it out before entering the building. This Thursday is the end of our door contest. Time is almost up. If you haven't already decorated your door, what are you waiting for? I can't wait to see your new designs. Did you know that K-5 reward for the software challenge will be a glow-in-the-dark party, and 6th through 8th will be enjoying some fries and wings. Well, that is going to happen once you complete your instructional software. The challenge will end March 15th. I wish you all the best of luck. Good news, everyone. We are having tryouts for sports. First sports tryout will be for girls' flag football. As required, you will need to have a completed sports physical and a 3.0 GPA. The trials will be on the 26th of this month. And the last sports tryouts will be for boys baseball. Remember to have a completed sports physical and a 3.0 GPA. The trials will be on the 12th of March. Wish you all the best of luck. Now let's go to Jay's Lane to find out the results of our boys first basketball game. Welcome back to Sports Patriots. On Thursday, our boys basketball team had a game against Cooper City. Unfortunately, the team lost 52 to 38. The players who performed the best were number 12, Derek Rowe, with the best offense, and number 10, Jeremiah Joseph, with the best defense. The cheerleaders definitely did a good job cheering at our game. I can't wait to see you guys at our next game. I hope you guys win. Bye, Patriots. Thanks for the highlights, Jaisleen. Hey, Patriots, today's weather is 70 degrees Fahrenheit with sunny skies. Make sure to pack a jacket. In other weather news, a recent study on polar bears in Canada reveals a struggle to adapt. This is caused by global warming. Global warming is caused when air pollution from cars, trucks, and other machines goes into the air. This melts the sea ice, causing there to be less land for the polar bears to stand on. Polar bears now have less places to live and are looking for food and swimming long distances. This is so concerning. Now let's switch our patriots happy birthday with Giselle. Thank you, Camila. Today's birthday boys and girls are Emmanuel Obian Wuzu, Desmond Kaw, Allison Rodriguez, our Rex Pines teacher, Miss Espert. Our belated birthdays are Mia Lima, our belated Rex Pines teacher's birthdays are Miss Z Williams. Happy birthday! Now let's go back to Aliyah. Thank you, Giselle. Patriots, here are your past expectations. It represents present yourself positively, act kindly towards others, treat the school's environment respectfully, and succeed at everything. Congrats to Miss Jordan, Miss Stone, Miss Carter, Miss Manon, and Miss Merkel for getting the correct answer to Friday's daily challenge, which was 
There's only one word in the dictionary that's spelled wrong. What is it? The correct answer was wrong. Today's daily challenge is... Daily Challenge! What goes up and down but doesn't move? Teachers, please send your answer to pines.renaissance at gmail.com before 9 a.m. in order for your answers to be reviewed. Winners will be announced on the next morning announcements. Everyone at RPTV would like to wish you all a terrific Tuesday. Have a great day!